Hey, my eightfold family, how y'all doing? Today is beautiful Thursday. Today is beautiful Thursday. I have in my bowl, I'm going to do a quick video because really right now what I'm doing, I'm catching up on the Gang of Thrones because season two, I mean, uh, they're going to come out with another Gang of Thrones, I guess, because this stopped at season eight. So... I'm catching up on it. I'm binging on it. Um, I'm off today. I took a couple of days off after Juneteenth or whatever. So right, at, what I have in here, y'all, is um, this is Argo, Argo box scented with um, great value box. I scented it with um, gain. Dry your sheets. Yes, yes, yes. It's been sent to me again. Dry your sheets. Plus, my bars are at the bottom, of course. But y'all just catching up on the Gang of Thrones. I'm on. I'm on season seven. Yeah, season seven. So got one more season to go, and then they're gonna. Then I'm gonna. Um. I don't know when they said they was gonna do the um start up the Gang of Thrones thrones again but i know i did um see it somewhere and heard the advertisement but anyway on stars of course so this is argo scented and great value scented with game dryer sheets so let's get some bites in i'm probably gonna do a probably 15 20 minutes not too much yeah, here you guys go. I hope I hope all is well as with everybody and you guys are having a good, good, good day. Mm. Mm. Mm 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 I should have got some water, a bottle of water. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My birthday week was great. I still got gifts coming in and stuff like that. See, the way my family do things is, and my family, whoever, okay, say your birthday is in June. So everybody in my family that's birthday in June, whatever your age is, we cash at you that price. So since I just turned 40, everybody in my family, from the oldest to the youngest, whoever got jobs or whatever, they cash at me $40 because of my age. In my family, that's what we do. That's basically your gift. So you, if you 58, 42, whatever like my mom she turned 50 57 my mom just turned 57 you know because men had on the same day i cash up cash up her 57 she cash at me 40. that's my gift to her that's that's her gift to me so that's how we do it so we won't have to be worrying about oh what to buy this person for as because 
and my family we believe in giving gifts so that so that's so to eliminate trying to go to the stores and stuff like that whatever your age is that's what you get cashed at so that's how we do things in my family Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and I have a big family. My grandma had six girls. Mm-hmm. And out of those six girls, my mama had my mom had the most. <clears throat> she had four kids, so the numbers are between my cousins are between three, three to two siblings, and um, as far as my aunties. My mom is the fourth oldest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. I plan on doing Lola once one bowl challenge. <clears throat> I'm gonna do it. I just gotta go to the family dollar and get I gotta go to the family dollar and get the bowl. The bowls with the nest. Yeah. And I also plan on going doing the duo with key shape. Keisha choose. I'm thinking, I don't know if I want to do it at the end of this month or just begin July or the beginning of July. Um, I'm definitely going to email her today. To get all her information so we can call each other and see what's best for her schedule, my schedule. So, yeah. Other than that, y'all, I'm good. I took off today, I took off tomorrow, so. Friday, I'm getting my hair touched up, I'm getting my lashes touched up, everything touched up on Friday. So, girl, I could be fresh to death on Monday. <laughs> mm hmm. But it's gonna frizz, it's gonna frizz up and everything. It's gonna frizz up, lift up. So, Niggas need to be put back in place. Yeah, but I was just saying to myself, I owe it to myself to get back to how I really was. This is this this look, it was me every other day. It's just that when I um went into moving and getting settled into a new city and just trying to Count like just it was a lot, it was a lot going on seven months ago in my life, even though I was still doing YouTube, 
coming out here eating and stuff like that. It was a, still a lot going on. Like life was life in seven months ago. Not even seven months ago because July will be a year since I've been here. So a year ago, almost a year ago, a lot was going on for me. I was moving, trying to find a place to stay, like all that. Had the cash, had everything, just nobody was not rent renting. Nobody was renting. But, I, but you know, God sh um, showed me favor and I found this place. Even though it's not, it's not what I'm used to, I had to adapt because I plan on staying here and doing what I was going to do before, before I left the other place I was at. The other place I was at, the landlord, he just started get, being too, too nasty and too shysty and stuff like that. So I was like, okay, it's time for me to make a move. Even though I didn't want to leave because I'm from that city. I'm from Miami Gardens. I born and raised in Miami Gardens. But... You know, I had to leave, and now I'm in the um, inner city of Libby City, but I'm on the side of the Adipata side. So, yeah, it was a, it was a, it was a struggle, touch and go. Like I said, it was, it was a kind of like a not a culture shock, but it was just like I'm not from this city, so a lot of things I saw, a lot of things um, I'm accustomed to, I was not accustomed to. You know, being on this side of the city, even though when I, you know, this this city that I live in now, I used to drive through it. I never stayed. I never had like a family member here, a friend here, nothing. So this city, I always drive through it to get to wherever I else, wherever else I was going. I never like had a pit stop. But like I'm saying, I'm thankful for the, I'm thankful for, for a roof over my head. I'm thankful for the place I have. I thank you for you know God allowing me to put food on my table. I'm thankful for everything. I'm thankful for my job. Everything, everything. I'm thankful for everything. My life, you know, everything. You know, I'm thankful for that. It's just that you know when I got here, it was very, it was it was shut such a shocker. I got shocker, but it was just like, you know, this is where I'm at now, so I got to adapt. But I did adapt, but that's just that's just what I've been, you know, feeling. Because I've been here for like a, almost a year now, so. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Hmm. Hey, y'all. This is the old Argo box. The one with the paper, um, the one with the paper bag and not the plastic bag. And this is great value in the box, not the hand. So it's two boxes in here and it's so good. Mm-hmm. This is great. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna get like some of these bars. And it's gonna be the end of the video. Not a oh family. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm.
I appreciate y'all still supporting me. I see I'm climbing up to 5K. I'm like, to God be the glory, y'all. <laughs> mm hmm. Our guy is awesome. For real. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say it again. If you don't set your starch, don't start. Because once you do it, you're not going to stop. You're never going to eat starch the same way again. If you eat it plain and then you start sensing it, don't do it. So each is own. Some people don't like it. But the majority, mostly everybody, mostly everybody I watch or I have seen since they starch some kind of way. Dry sheets, bars, you know, sticking them in, sticking them in is a spot where, you know, mm -mm. Mm, 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 mm. This weekend, one of my um my eight four families was um in Miami. We couldn't link up because uh. Things came up for me, and things um came up for her, but <clears throat> now I have her number. She locked in. She's also one of my mods, so this week we was conversing. And she planned on coming back down. And I said, better circumstances. Because she really wasn't here to hang out. She was here to support her daughter. So. One day. One day. One day I would love to meet all you guys. Like a meet and greet. But I gotta have a venue. And it gotta be a meet and greet would be nice, probably like at a uh soul food place or or seafood place or like a all you can eat seafood place or something like that. That would be dope. We'll have a catering company come um serve food and stuff like that. I don't know.
Mm. 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 I'm gonna go my 15 minutes. That's okay. Mm. Oh, look at this one. That's why I'm through, being through it all. But it's still good. It's still giving what I need to get. Mm-hmm. Well, that's monotonous, at least. One of my faves. I'm doing this video because tomorrow I ain't gonna be able to do no, do no videos. My niece and nephews, my nieces and my nephew, they coming over. Y'all, they got a lot. They got a lot. I have half a box of Argo, half a box of great value. And no bottom, probably, probably about Saturday night. It, it might be gone because I put. I put game dryer sheets inside the boxes so that the Argo and the um, Great Value can continue to be scented. I put dryer sheets inside the boxes. So, yeah.
Mm-hmm. Sure did. So it's gonna be extra sending. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm so good. Hopefully, I won't indulge in it more than what I did just now. That was actually them getting dry sheets, baby. Even though, even when I was just using the game box, there was no dry sheets in there. It was scented very well. But you actually put like one or two in there, depending on your scent level or how strong you want it. Or how, if you want it slightly scented, one dry sheet will do the job. If you want it less, you want it light, lighter than that, just put the game box in there. And just sit there and let it sit right on top of the starch. Amazing. For me, I like it right on top. <clears throat> or whatever. And I got and I, like I said, I got some inside the boxes of Argo and um the great value box. So I got some I got gang sit in there. Since it's sheets in there on top of the box. But y'all, thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all are having a beautiful day. You have a beautiful week. Cause I like I said, Friday I ain't even gonna be on here. I'm gonna be running with the chicken with my head cut off because my niece and nephew are going to be here at my house so i love you guys thank you for supporting y'all spread love keep this in this world because there's too much hate out there stay positive stay prayed up keep god first and everything that you do and i promise you it'll work out for the best you will always have your best interest at heart. Always. So, yeah, my eight foes. Thank you for coming through. I don't know if I'm going to edit this. If I edit it, it's going to take like maybe a day or two to come out. But if I just post it right, right now without no editing, without no edit, <clears throat> it posts right now. But then again, I don't know because YouTube be acting crazy with uh, uploads. But, all right, guys, see you next time.